Under the picturesque capital of Hungary, there is a secret place which is one of the best playgrounds for underwater robots one can find. The partially flooded Kerbanya Mine. It is a well-known and safe training location for cave divers, who kindly gave way to the UNEXUP team to use it as a test location for the UX-1 NEO robot. The water is clear and we can find all the necessary features to challenge the robot's abilities. There are big chambers interconnected with narrow passages, multi-level tunnels, and different kinds of ladders and stairways. While we can find abandoned mining equipment as well. For instance, this wheelbarrow is a perfect object for the structured light scanner devices. Just like this rusty spiral staircase, which is also not something easy to follow for the navigation systems. Thanks to the sophisticated propulsion, even the required delicate movements can be implemented. The straight tunnels are good for fine-tuning the automated distance-keeping algorithms. While because of the occasional obstacles, the object avoidance can be tested at the same time. In fact, the UX-1 was able to explore a 300 meters long tunnel section alone, still connected to the cable but without human intervention. Being confident, the team decides to make a historical move. They detach the umbilical cord and let the robot explore the mine entirely on its own. There is no connection between the robot and the surface, so they are completely powerless in case of any malfunction. The UX-1 NEO has to make decisions based on the onboard mapping devices. At the end of the staircase, there is a chamber, and the robot has to go all the way, turn back, and return to the starting point. This situation is quite novel and also frustrating for the team. The dive should take approximately 15 minutes. Until then, they can only hope for the best. The blinking light at the end of the tunnel comes as a relief. But only flawless performance counts as a success. Where the robot never touches the wall and arrives back to the initial location with high precision. The mission is completed. fully autonomous dive was achieved for the first time.